YouTube, it's Kay and I'm back with another video. Today I'm going to be doing, finally, what is in me and my baby's diaper bag. So mommy and baby, you know, let me get this out the way. <laughs> let me bring it up down for real, for real. But, um, so I'm in his room right now. I have his diaper bag right here. I got this diaper bag at Target. And this is going to be his um, hospital bag. You know, I have all his stuff in here right now. So I'm going to show y'all what's in his bag first. And then I'm going to show y'all what's in mine. Sorry about the lighting, y'all. I tried to catch that natural light before the sun went down. But it's about to storm outside. So let's get through trying to, you know, before it gets straight up pitch black on me. You know what I'm saying? So, okay, y'all. So right here I have three blankets so got one with little clouds one with just little stripes and then this blue one so he has three blankets in there I think three is good cuz I mean you know if everything goes smooth we really shouldn't be in the hospital that long so you know and then on top of underneath that what am I talking about I have onesies is it really about the rain right now if y'all hear the rain, I'm sorry about that. So, for his onesies, okay, my baby is already 7 pounds, like, right now. So, I don't know how big he's going to be. He was 7 pounds for my last ultrasound. So, I really don't know. It really just started raining, y'all. Like, for real, for real. So, I really don't know um, how big he's going to be and, like, what size he's going to be. Because I feel like this is so little. Like, I don't know. Like, I feel like he's not going to be able to fit this. So, I have a newborn onesie. I have two newborn onesies. And then I have a zero to three. And then I have a three month. I have two three months. Only because, y'all, look. This is zero to three, right? And then this is three months. So... You know, just in case, depending on how big he is, you know, I don't want him to be all squished and all. I mean, worst coming to worst, you have to come back home and get a different size. But I packed newborn zero to three and three months, so he should be good. I'm going to probably pack another zero to three just in case, so he'll have two of each, depending on which size that he needs. And then I have this little Mickey Mouse hat. He has one full outfit in here, so it's this Mickey Mouse hat with these little Mickey Mouse pants. And then it comes with this onesie. This is all newborn right here. So actually he has two outfits because he has one for pictures. And then this is just another outfit. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's going to be hot. So I don't know if he's going to wear those pants or not. But you know, I don't know. And then I have a sleeper right here. I have two sleepers in here. This one is a size 0 to 3. So you know. It's a little bit bigger you know zero to three so that should be good and i also have a newborn sleeper in here too so i would definitely say like depending on i mean if you know how big your baby is and you know you're about to have a small baby then you probably be good with newborn but with my baby i don't know so i'm packing newborn and zero to three and a couple three months just in case you know what i'm saying and then i have two little washcloths in here and then i have a burp cloth I'm probably going to pack one more burp cloth or like one or two more burp cloths. I just bought some more burp cloths today so I have to wash those. And then we got one of those safety kits at our um, at our baby shower. So that's basically what's packed in here if I can. Why did I tie this so tight? Oh, I ain't tied that tight. So I have like everything that came in a safety clip, uh, safety kit. So I have like his comb, his brush, his little thingy for the nose, his little thermometer. Even though I'm pretty sure he's not gonna need all this stuff, but it's gonna be in his diaper bag anyway. So you know, y'all know what I'm saying. And then I do have one full pack of diapers that's not open. So this is newborn diapers, which he should be good in because it says up to 10 pounds. So this should be good just for the hospital. Like if he is bigger and needs like, you know, a size one diaper, 
then we'll handle that when we get home. But for our hospital, he should be good with those. Let me put this stuff back in here. And then I have some pacifiers. They're still in this because I still have to boil them. So, you know, just the sanitary reasons. And then I have some of his socks right here. I have three pairs of socks. Oh, his little socks. And then right here is another one of his little outfits. It's a little Nike fit, y'all know. Y'all know my boy gonna be fresh or whatever. Little hand mittens because can't have him scratching himself. His hat. And then his onesie. So look out for pictures in this outfit because, you know, coming soon. And then I did, you know, at the hospital, they don't take a full bath. So I just packed him um, some lotion. I didn't pack, like, any body wash or anything because pretty sure he's not going to need it for the hospital because he's not going to take a full bath. So I just packed some lotion. We are using a vino and baby dove. So I just packed a full bottle, even though we're not going to need a full bottle for the hospital, but... And like I said, he's not taking a full bath, but I packed a towel anyway because, you know, I don't know. And then me, I am getting my son um, circumcised, so I did pack him his own Vaseline. So, you know, after they do, because they say, you know, I give birth and then they pretty much take him after birth and do the procedure and then they bring him back. So... This will be getting put, you know, on his area so he can heal properly, fast, you know what I'm saying? That's just for him, though. And then, you know, me, I've been real germy about everything. So, I have this, um, this is not, I don't even think this is like a hand soap. Like, this is foam and dish plus bottle soap. I don't know. I've seen a girl on YouTube using for her baby, and she had great reviews on it. So, I have this plus I have hand sanitizer so anybody that think they want to touch my baby I would like them to wash their hands with this and then put this hand sanitizer on because this hand sanitizer is alcohol free this is the baby Gannics um hand sanitizer so you know yeah. you know if they want to hold him I would like them to Please wash your hands and put hand sanitizer on because people are germy. You know what I'm saying? So let me go ahead and pack all this stuff up. And then on the side of his diaper bag, I'm going to have three pack his bag. It has a slot for his wipes. So this is a full pack of wipes right here. And then on the other side, I can keep bottles in here. So even though I'm planning on breastfeeding at the hospital, but you know, if that don't work out, I'm going to probably pack some bottles just in case. But I'm hoping I don't have to use the bottles. Not right now, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so that's all his stuff as of right now. I don't think it's something else I'm going to be adding to. I might add like some more socks and burp cloth and stuff like that. But pretty much, that's all his stuff. So now I'm going to show y'all what's in my bag. You know what I'm saying? What's in mommy's bag? So in here, I bought some socks. These are just, I really wanted black socks. But they didn't have black socks at Walmart. So I just got a pack of white socks because I really, honestly, anything that I wear in the hospital, I really don't want to bring it back home. Like, I don't know, hospital just kind of, eh, to me, like, eh, it's kind of dirty to me. So I just, like, if I wear these in the hospital, I'm probably not going to wear them again, to be honest. So it's kind of just socks just to have for the hospital. And then I got this nursing bra, you know, which, you know, y'all know flip it milk it you know what I'm saying like I only got one but you know a nursing bra for the hospital and then I bought a pack of underwear again I wanted dark underwear because you know ladies pregnant ladies you know why I want dark underwear but um they didn't have dark like they had nothing in black like I'm like y'all got all these whites and colors I know it's summer but dang but yeah I bought a pack of underwear and these are like the brief like the big boys, you know what I'm saying? Mm. I think I'm missing a pair of drawers. Oh, I found them. Okay, let me show y'all. So yeah, they like the the big, <laughs> they like the big boys, the granny pants, which is what I needed because you know they said to bring comfortable underwear. Even though they, I heard they give you like underwear to wear in the hospital, but you know, 
and this isn't packed right now but this will be in my bag it's my scarf from my body y'all because you know I got my braids done for labor but I still got to keep them tight though so you know this isn't in my bag right now because I need it tonight but it will be in my bag and then I have a towel and washcloth because you know take it probably gonna take a shower there so buy my own towel my own washcloth because like I say you know I'm kind of funny acting so and then I have this shirt honestly y'all I really didn't know what to pack like I've watched videos I've looked at checklists but honestly y'all I was just throwing stuff in the bag because I don't know so I bought this shirt this is a loose shirt this is a large so after I have the baby and my stomach you know probably will go down a little bit I should still be able to fit this so this is just like a comfortable shirt for me to maybe wear when, when I'm leaving the hospital or I don't know because most of the time I'm probably gonna be naked in a gown right so yeah I don't know but then I also packed a tank just because you know I packed a lot of tanks like I packed red and black tanks because you know I could boom you know what I'm saying like I ain't want to bring too many shirts and plus I'm sure it's gonna be hot so and y'all look I ordered me this cute little robe you know cause after I had a baby I want to be feeling all you know mommy-ish so I ordered me a mommy robe and it's blue because I'm having a boy but it got pink on it because I'm a girl so you know like imagine me look look I'm like a mommy holding my baby <gasps> and oh my god it kind of got like y'all know that bird when you're having a baby like it'd be y'all know what I'm talking about I answered a picture but yeah order me this robe only because I've seen people in the video they said to bring a robe with you for after so you don't have to like sit around in the gown so you could just be in this chilling so I'm gonna definitely be naked in my robe and then I have some biker shorts because, girl, it, when I went to the hospital just a couple days ago, it was hot. So, I don't really want to be wearing no pants. I guess, you know, it's summer. It was 90 degrees out today. I brought shorts and tanks because, another tank, because it's going to be hot. So, this is another pair of shorts I brought. These just some Nike shorts. Black ones. And honestly, these are ones I don't really care if they get, like, if they was to get messed up so that's why I brought that I did pack one pair of kind of these are like sweats they're like sweat leggings if that makes sense so if I do decide or if it is cold for some reason I do have a pair of pants I can put on oh, okay I have two my mom did help me pack this so I guess she packed another pair I was looking for these girl I'm not wearing these to the hospital I love you mama but that's my good pair of Nikes right there you know what I'm flip-flops for either these are really probably just gonna be for the shower because like I said funny acting I don't really want to be stepping on the floor or if I'm just walking around the um the room because I didn't really pack I don't really have any slippers to pack I'm probably gonna get some I don't know what I got in here this is just another tank I got some loose shorts these are like old cheer shorts I had since like high school but they're like bigger so I see they got bleach on them so you know if these do get destroyed in the process it's okay and then I got another shirt I packed honestly all the seven pictures I'm not gonna need this is just my senior shirt just a big comfy shirt I have mine in black and gray and another tank okay you know how many tanks did you pack and then let me see this is gonna be like my toiletry size so I have this little bag that's not zipped because it can't zip but this has maxi pads right here these are my maxi pads you know these are like the he um, heavy weight overnight like the long ones and then I have um, nursing pads right here so I didn't know how many I was gonna need so I tried to stuff this boy pretty fat cuz I know um, I have some lotion in here I have real dry skin so this is the lotion that I use and it's not packed right now but I'm gonna have I might get another deodorant I'm pretty sure I'm gonna go to the store and I want to get another deodorant and like a pack of toothbrushes just to take because I really don't want to take my toothbrush to the hospital because so yeah I want to get a pack of toothbrushes which is gonna be in there then I have this I have this from the dentist 
I might have an extra toothbrush already that I could just pack the one. Like, you know the ones they give you at the dentist, the little baby ones? I'll probably pack that if I have one. So, yeah, guys. So, and then, like, stuff that's not packed in there right now that's going to be packed. Let me see. Like, um, my camera, clearly. My camera, my camera charger. Um, I'm not taking my laptop because I don't plan on doing no editing in the hospital like I would do all that when I get home and settled and all that so you know um my charger for my phone probably some headphones if I want to listen to music I don't know how I'm gonna be feeling so um we're gonna have an extra either a towel or some type of like old blanket just to have in the they said to have it in the car like just in case I'm like leaking I guess I don't know so we'll have that in the car. We have his car seat that'll be in the car. So I'm trying to think. Oh, and then you know, like the basic stuff like ID, um, insurance. I'm gonna. They told me to print out like a um like a birth plan. So you know, basically that's just telling them exactly how you want like everything. To <laughs> Kayla. They tell you like exactly everything, like how you want it to go. Like if you want to do like the the water birth method, or if you want to walk a lot, or if you don't want to walk a lot, or if you know, basically just how you want it to go. If you want an epidural, if you don't, you know. If you want people in the room, if you don't, people in the room. So I'm gonna print out a birth plan, and I'm gonna have that along with you know ID and insurance and all that good stuff. And y'all, I think that's pretty much it. Like, I've seen people videos, and y'all be having suitcases packed. But honestly, oh, one more thing I'm gonna bring is a blanket. I'm gonna put that in there. It's not in there right now, but I'm packing a blanket as well. So, I'm gonna put the picture of the checklist up that I use to help me pack my bag. Cause honestly, it wasn't off the dome. I ain't gonna lie. So, you know, I'm gonna just share that with y'all if y'all are going to use it. But my mama's out there that's been commenting lately. You know, if y'all got any advice on stuff I should pack or stuff I should take out, let me know. Cause you know, he's still in there. So we we still got time. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I'm trying to think. I think that's everything. Oh, I'll probably take my own soap too, like a bar of soap for the shower. Yeah. I'm not gonna take like no shampoo or nothing like that because I'm not I don't plan on washing my hair. And I don't wear makeup, so I don't need like makeup or nothing like that. So yeah, y'all, my bag I think it's pretty simple compared to like videos that I've seen. But you know, this is just my bag, his bag. Y'all seen it all here, you know. That I have his bag packed and you know have his stuff, but you know. Yeah, so if you guys like this video, you know, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Leave comments below if you know if you know anything I should have, I shouldn't have. Like, let me know for real, for real. But I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.